Let's talk about Hawkeye Episode 3. I haven't even seen it yet. Oh, hi. It's the best geek news. Hello, hello. Welcome to Episode 497. Hawkeye spoilers will be at the very end of the show, but we've got news before that. First up, we now know the official rating for both Spider-Man No Way Home and Jurassic World Dominion. Tony! Hold on to your butts. Here's a big hint. Neither one of them are rated R. Would you settle for PG-13? Who could have seen that coming? Speaking of Spider-Man, last night my boy BD held a quarantine watch party on Twitter for Spider-Man Homecoming, and it appears we overlooked Spidey's new black suit making an appearance all the way back in that movie. Well, how about that? Mark your calendars, it's the next quarantine watch party of Spider-Man Far From Home and is going down on December 7th, so if you're on Twitter, go check that out. Not for nothing, last night Tom Holland took to social media to share a meme featuring Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man, and this is just the worst kept secret of all time at this point, right? How'd that get in there? As some of you may know, I've been in space for like a year and a half now. I was in a bunker during quarantine for 138 days. After 138 days in this bunker, it's time I bid you all adieu. But being the crafty guy I am, I built a spaceship and have now been delivering the nerd news from the final frontier. Getting a little homesick, so today we are going live with my editor and Earth correspondent Nick Floyd to see if it's safe for me to return to my home planet. So dial up Nick's space computer. Dial me. Hello, Nick. Hey, Chris. It's great to see you. Is it safe for me to return to Earth yet? Yeah, Chris, no, not really. It's uh, it's pretty horrible here, actually. Uh, Dubstep is trending on Twitter. Pete Davidson and Kim Kardashian are apparently a thing. Dr. Oz is running for Senate. Omicron. And I didn't even get Spider-Man tickets on Monday. Oh, really? Yeah, it's all pretty uh, You should You should definitely stay in space for as long as you can. Probably until the next, just as long as you can. Okay. Okay. Thanks, Nick. We'll check in with Nick next week and see if Earth's got better or not. Speaking of Nick, the big screen return of Nicolas Cage continues as he's been cast in the role of Dracula in Universal Pictures' monster movie Renfield, and I love it. All right, slight spoilers ahead for Hawkeye Episode 3. Because of Thanksgiving, we didn't get to talk about Hawkeye last week, and so far I really dig the vibe of the show. Not sure I would call it my favorite Disney plus Marvel show so far, but it's certainly not my least favorite. Which is? That's not the point. Episode 3 was definitely the best episode yet, and I love that we got to finally spend some time with Echo. Hmm, wonder whose hand that's gotta be. He's my friend. I gotta admit, it's pretty ironic that we've studied these hands of the two dudes from Hell's Kitchen who actually deal with the hand. Coincidence? I think not. Hey, hope you enjoyed the show. Find me on Twitter at Chris Killian or Instagram at CK Comedy. Make sure you give the video a thumbs up for support and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our other videos.